Hi, I'm Miss Michelle from the Robinson Branch, and today we're going to do an author study on Misha Archer. Her real name is Michelle Archer, but her parents always just called her Misha. She says a lot of people say it wrong. They'll call her Micah or Mika, but it's Misha, and it rhymes with fish, wish, Trisha, and Michigan. You can find her website at www.mishaarcher.com. Ms. Archer taught kindergarten for 15 years where books were her favorite teaching tool. And she worked as a carpenter for another 15 years. And now she says she finally spends her time doing what she loves best, writing and illustrating books for children. Daniel Finds a Poem is the first book that Ms. Archer both wrote and illustrated. And she said she enjoyed writing because it was almost like solving a puzzle to get just the right words. To create her illustrations, she works in oil, watercolors, pen and ink, and collage. She creates layered pieces from various materials on paper and digitally. In addition to those materials, she also makes her own homemade stamps and uses them in her artwork. And you may wonder, how does she do that? And she has a video on her website that shows you exactly that. Did you know that you could make stamps from things that you have around the house? In this short clip from her YouTube video, Miss Archer makes stamps using wooden blocks, rubber bands, and bicycle inner tubes. She creates a stamp pad with a very thin layer of acrylic paint, and this could become the background in one of her books. You can click on her sketchbook and see some of the sketches she's done. Um, some of them are in color, some of them are pen and ink. The ones I've included here just kind of made me smile. On her website, under her menu, you can also find a list of the books that she has either written or illustrated, like Snowman Minus Cold equals Puddle. To find titles by Ms. Archer that the library owns, you can go to our website at mcl.org and click on our catalog and type in her name, and that'll bring up a list of books that she's both written and illustrated. And if you find one that you'd like, you can place a hold on it by clicking on the three buttons on the side here, and then clicking place hold, and then entering your library card number and your PIN number. Ms. Archer was kind enough to send us a video of her reading her newest picture book, Wonder Walkers. And after hearing her read, I am ready to go on my very own Wonder Walk, and I hope that you will be too. Thank you, Ms. Archer. Hi, my name is Misha Archer, and I'm going to read you Wonder Walkers today. Wonder Walkers. Wonder Walkers. Dedicated to my friend Layla. Wonder Walk? Sure. Is the sun the world's light bulb? Is fog the river's blanket? Do mountains have bones? Are forests the mountain's fur? I wonder. Me too. Are trees the sky's legs? Our branches, trees, arm. Is dirt the world's skin?
our roots, the plant's toes. Do caves have mouths? Our shells, the shore's necklace. Is the ocean the world's bath? Are rivers the world's veins, the earth's veins? Is the wind the world's breathing? Is rain the day's tears? Is the moon the world's nightlight? How about taking a wonder walk? Good idea.